Action Aid Nigeria has announced the appointment of a new board of directors who will lead the organization for the next few years. The new board members were elected at the organization's 16th annual general meeting in Abuja. Narabi Isma was elected as the new chairperson, succeeding Dr. Jumai Omar Ajijola and Dr. Malcolm Mwabwala, was elected as the vice chairman. During the meeting, the General Assembly and the newly elected board members discussed the current state of the nation and provided recommendations for the country. We commend the federal government on the recent exemption of small businesses, manufacturers and farmers from the payment of withholding tax. This move acknowledges the critical role of local industries and small and medium enterprises in driving economic growth and development. However, the administration has also been impaired by several economic and monetary policies, which have negatively impacted the economy, inflation, food and transportation costs. More than emboldened to challenge government to do better than it is doing as far as insecurity in the country is concerned. At the moment, the insecurity in Nigeria is overwhelming. Action Aid has been shouting about this at the top of his voice for several years. And what we have been seeing is a deterioration of the situation, which should not be. Arabi Isma outlined the key initiatives of the newly inaugurated board, which includes a plan to lift 5 million Nigerians out of poverty through the board Renewed Citizens Action Program. We, we launched the country strategy paper, which is looking at citizens' action to end poverty and injustice. And it's a 10-year strategy broken down into segments of what we want to achieve over the next two years, over the next five years, over the next 10 years, working with partners, working with um, like minds, focusing on programs that focus on those people that we're, we're targeting. It will be very possible for us to convince our stakeholders, governments, politicians, that we should toss up the report of that uh, national conference. We think it is something that is very, very important and will change so many things in this country if those uh, in the report, in the recommendations of that report is in the report in for and consider. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.